Assalamualaikum and hi guys. Today, I will share with you the string test that I did for my Ender 3 V2 and how I did it. Watch this video to see my stringing test result. I'm using this smaller base stringing test file. I use the standard quality setting. The infill is set to 20% and the layer height is 0.2mm. For this test, I control the retraction distance and speed. What I did is, I increased the retraction distance by 0.5mm until 8.5mm. Then, I repeat this process by increasing the retraction speed by 10mm per second until 45mm per second. By the way, this is depending on the PLA brand you use. I'm using the Sunlu filament with the recommended temperature of 200 to 230 degrees Celsius. I will be running this experiment at 200 degrees Celsius and the bed temperature is 60 degrees Celsius which tested to be able to provide the best print quality. In the first batch, the retraction speed is fixed at 25mm per second with the retraction distance set from 6.5 default to 8.5mm with an increment of 0.5mm. If you look carefully at the printed model, you can actually see that there is a slight reduction of string as the retraction distance is increasing. What happens here is the retraction distance is actually the amount of filament that will be retracted by the extruder from the nozzle when it travels mid-air from one side to the other. Retracting is to prevent oozing or known as stringing. In the second batch of this experiment, I have tried increasing the retraction speed to 35mm per second and as a result, the stringing actually reduced at a retraction distance of 7.5mm. The result acquired from 7.5mm to 8.5mm looks similar. Since the stringing still exists, I have attempted a third experiment with a higher retraction speed, hoping to eliminate the string completely. However, the string didn't change much compared to the speed of 35mm per second. As for my final attempt, I have decided to reduce the nozzle temperature to 190 degrees Celsius with the optimum retraction speed and distance acquired from experiment 2. That is retraction distance of 7.5mm and retraction speed of 35mm per second. The result turns out very good. With this test, I can conclude that the nozzle temperature plays a huge role in ensuring the reduction of stringing apart from retraction distance and speed. If you guys manage to do it or have any suggestion on this, please share with me. That's all for today. I'm Suat from Cytron Technologies. Thank you for watching.